Hi guys, today I'm going to be doing a video unboxing of the Xiaomi Mi 2. Um, this is the Mi Phone 2, this is the second phone released by Xiaomi, which comes installed with the MIUI ROM. So this is the box, as you can see this is the 32GB version, and here I presume in Chinese it says that it's running on this S4 quad core 1.5 GHz Snapdragon processor and it says some stuff in Chinese here fortunately I don't understand Chinese so we'll just get with the unboxing uh, and guys first of all please don't ask me how I got hold of this phone I mean God only knows because I had someone take buy it for me from China so don't ask me if it's available in India or if it's available in US or stuff like that I don't really know I really don't know at all so I got this in China where apparently it's quite easily available but yeah I have no idea about anywhere else so guys here's the phone and it's extremely light so I presume the battery is not in it feels kind of empty too yeah I don't think the battery is inside so that means this has a removable battery and we'll just take a look at the phone a little later taking this off as we can see it doesn't look like there's an extra battery so I'll just have to check anyways so this is this is the um, wall adapter and in here goes the USB cable of course and this is the micro USB the USB cable I don't even think I need to take that out um, both of these this has the this has the MI logo on it and this this obviously is a cable so it might not have the logo but I think it does I think I just saw it through the transparent paper yeah here it is it does say MI on you can see that it does say MI on the USB cable too so a lot of branding MI UI is doing around here this must be the oh there you go there is a battery so I was like what how can the phone even be that light but yeah there is a battery so anyways so this is the documentation but unfortunately it's all in Chinese and here it tells you how to take out the battery cover and put in your sim and all so we can just like follow the diagrams or figure it out for ourselves because this is in Chinese and I have no idea how to read that and there is one more thing inside this and this is the quality service something again in Chinese I presume that's right this is again Chinese this is probably like a license certificate saying that this is an official Xiaomi Me Too product thing God only knows I mean I have no idea anyway so here's the battery that's a 2000 milliampere per battery but um, we get more to that when I talk about specs and now getting back to the phone moving this stuff away ah, how do I open this thing wow this is pretty hard to open just give me a sec oh that was quite a task so I mean moving the back cover is actually quite hard anyways I'm just gonna put my sim card in as you can see it takes only full sim cards it doesn't take a micro sim card or a nano sim card like the new iPhone 5 anyways here's a 2000 milliampere battery it's called a BM20 battery and we just put that in as you can see here this is an 8 megapixel camera it's the speakers this is the flash the 8 megapixel camera is capable of recording 1080p video at 30 frames per second this is the orange battery and as you can see there's these two orange dots on both sides um, if you guys didn't know this orange is the color scheme of MIUI which is a custom ROM and MIUI is the custom ROM that is preloaded into this phone as this phone is made by the guys that made MIUI and one more interesting thing is the back cover now the back cover actually has a mesh so that the sound comes out of these speakers is enhanced and it has um, these the volume rocker and the power button uh, kind of integrated in the back cover so you can see these three pressure points on the phone they're not actually buttons but when you put the cover on this kind of presses against the pressure points and then you have working buttons on the cover so that's actually quite interesting now we just pop the phone back in its cover hopefully that's not as hard as getting it off the phone yeah so there we go it just clicks into place nicely 
and now I'll give you a tour of the phone on the left side we don't have anything on the bottom we have the micro USB uh, port and the mic here we have the power button and the volume rocker on top we do not have the power button since this is a long phone and the makers of this phone must have thought that it's more convenient to just you know have it on the side so that's what they did and of course on top we have a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and speaking of a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack I just realized that I don't think there were any earphones in the box and yeah I'm right they we weren't provided with any earphones in the box so we're just given like the micro USB the USB cable and the wall adapter that's all that's come in the box besides the phone and the battery and of course the documentation but how's that matter so moving on so this is um, the Xiaomi Mi 2 and here you can see it's written mi www.xiaomi.com and up here also you have mi written on the phone it looks extremely nice and it feels solid it's decently light and it's not heavy at all <coughs> and um, it's uh, actually uh, got a 4.3 inch screen uh, 720 by 1280p resolution so it's an HD screen and since the screen is a uh, is a 4.2 inch screen, its footprint is actually a lot smaller than the other phones such as the Samsung Galaxy S2, etc. I mean, I find this smaller or at least much more manageable than the S2. I mean, I just feel that this is a much better shape than the S2 had. And I'll just do a small comparison with some of my other phones like the BlackBerry Torch here. You guys can see that. The torch having a 4.2 inch, uh, the 3.2 inch screen, sorry, and of course my LG Optimus One, which you guys have probably seen in my other videos. This also having a uh, 3.2 inch screen, and the Mi 2 having a 4.3 inch screen. So you can see the size comparison. It is the largest, longest, and the thinnest out of the three phones. Sorry, I don't have any other similar dimensional phones to show you guys. Anyways, moving on. So. I've told you guys now about the technical specifications of the phone. Um, this thing has a front facing camera, <coughs> a rear camera with uh, which is 8 megapixels and capable of 1080p of HD video recording at 30 frames per second. Uh, it's running the MIUI custom ROM. It comes pre-rooted. It's got the three Android buttons, the menu key, the home key and the back key. It's running uh, Android Jelly Bean 4.1.1 which is overlaid by the MIUI and to get there isn't a specific or a proprietary um, multitasking button yes you'll have to hold the home button for that and uh, don't be hating on me if you guys think that this is not the first unboxing this is actually the first time I've opened this box but you might have seen some stuff like the screen protector on this gone that's probably because I told the guy that was getting me the phone to change the language to English since he knew both Chinese and English so he did that for me and I thank him very much if he's watching this video. Uh, moving on, so I was telling you that this is uh, that this has got a 4.3 inch 720 by 1280p screen, the three buttons, Android buttons, volume rocker, home button, 8 megapixel camera, 1080p recording, 30 frames per second. And now the main thing, I mean this this is what makes this phone. It's running on a quad core S4 snapdragon processor with 2 gb of ram so i mean me coming from a phone like the lg optimus one this is going to be a huge upgrade this is like the most top of the line phone like nexus 4 specs this phone has and i mean this is i'm just really excited to check out the performance on this and i'll put up a review as soon as i can let's just see if this has enough juice to start up even a bit so yeah guys that's probably going to be the first boot it's probably going to take a while since it's the first boot so thank you guys very much